Hello first tube, Frankie here. So I haven't been on in ages. That's just been really busy. And um, today I've got haul, current whips, other whips, and a new storage and system I'm trying out. Um, so I'm going to start with the haul as it goes into whips. Um, so let's start. Um, I become a member on so and so they're doing a new thing where you become a member get free standard delivery digital download charts each month and when you sign up they give you a hamper I actually did it and got my hamper it's a mystery one so you don't know what you get in it comes in this little straw I would say really nice and inside you have this is what I have got I've got these two threads always handy and I've got this little kit sorry about the glue also with it the sand, sea and cross stitch over 50 style cross stitch patterns I really love I love that one as well sail away with me It's the most fun. So I really like that. And I've got this kit. I'm not sure if I'm going to stitch this. I might do sorry my webcam's flashing at me. I might do a giveaway, I'm not too sure. I really enjoyed becoming a member sort of thing I think it is. And getting a free hamper. I really love this part. And it comes with a load of stuff as well. <coughs> Shove that over there. And then I also ordered this kit. Little Santa Claus from Mill Hill. It is the Sanfer H124 holiday pin. And I've got holiday pin XI H99 Mr. Claw. So there. And I've got also from that order. I got my my brother's getting married, so I got a historical sampler company. I do wedding sampler. That's the kit. Then they get married in May and it's going to be in Greece. Then off eBay, 
I'm being banned from eBay. I won this, which is the Christmas stocking stockings by David and Charles Cross Stitch Collections, designed by Joan and Leah, Sam Hoskins, Brenda Keith, and Gideon Shooter. Sorry if I've been up any of them wrong. And they've got some really lovely designs. I think I'm going to stitch this one. And then off eBay again, I think all of these were in the same one. I only got it for this one. Or this is it carousel horse? Yeah, carousel horse there. That one there. We've got some really lovely and this is a the Omen book fourth in the series. And I've also got cottages in cross-stitch. Which has a really nice autumn one. <coughs> and cross-stitch fairies, six magical designs. This is American School of Needlework. Number three six three three. Oh, this one's really nice. The Christmas Fairy. Then I got Skinny Mini Snow by Charlene Designs. And that come with the thread and the little thing that I skate charms. And then with that bundle I got the art cross number one. Um Dreams of a Child Dreams of a Childhood. Garden Bears. I love this one. Of the two bears. The ultimate flower book. The life is a song by Stony Creek. <coughs> the sunset. This one's by. Norman Rockwell Stony Creek Collection and I got the third in the series Omen book for Beds and Barbs just mostly flowers in this one I think that little cat's so cute might actually make some towels
did you get towels you cross stitch on from? If anyone knows, let me know in the comments below. I might do some. Bashful bunnies. Bashful bunny. Them two are so cute. And so them two. They're my favourite out this one. And the Garfield, what is your sign? The memorabilia Winter White Santa. I've got all the DMC to go with this one. I haven't got the special threads or beads yet. Because um, my one of my other brothers is having a baby. I got the white willow stitching it's a boy but I'm not going to do that yet I'm going to put his name date of birth and his weight and then last bit of haul I got this little storage from Amazon Really cool. It has a bit up here, and then it has mm. it four of these little containers. So that's it for my haul. I'm just gonna move. I won't need that one. Stay over there. Oh, there's a needle there. storage as I've just shown you that. The way I'm planning on doing it, I'm doing I've got a box this one which I'm gonna hold the whips that I want to work on and finish concentrate on finishing and then I'm gonna store their threads in these boxes like this one has the night before Christmas sled and my brother's baby sampler so I'm going to store them in there and then take it out when I'm working on them so the way I'm doing things now is I'm going to have whips that I concentrate on then when I finish them I'm either going to get an old whip that I have in my other's pile or I'm going to be able to do a new start and maybe buy some more things so, <coughs> sorry, I'm just gonna have a drink. Moving on to current whips, and then I'll do the whips that I'm focusing on, and then I will move on to other whips that got that are not finished. 
that I want to carry on with. Ones that I don't want to carry on with. Probably under my bed with my four massive boxes of all my positive stuff. It's getting a bit out of control. But I love it. I don't care. So, let's do my work with. So, I work the Labrook. As you can tell, I've nicked one of their lottery plastic wallets for my work. They actually come in handy, these. Um, so, my work one is the Holiday Pin XL. And I've done this much. That much of it. The two presents, two feet, the little bit of Santa, and some of his jacket. That's what I've done so far. So I only really work at this at work when I'm not busy, so probably in the evening from 7 o'clock till 10 o'clock because I do 13 hour shifts which start Monday to Friday 8 in the morning till 10 10 at night and then Saturday half 7 till 10 10 Sundays are 9 till 10 10 so that is what I'm working on at work my little pin which that needle fell off from so just going to clip it on the back of that the magnets, you get magnets in there which I might make needle winders with I'm not too sure yet because I'm going to make this into an ornament and that just goes in my handbag like that so that's a work one where it is a focus, but it's not. It's just like to do work, really. Um, and then my brother's one, which I've started, which is on 28 count Brittany Ice Blue. Size is 19 by 27. And I'm using. Oh, what do you see on there? BMC 955 no 995 so I've only done one foot up She really found out I really like working on 28 count. My brother picked these colours. I gave him God knows how many blues in DMC, but he picked this colour. That one. Where have I put my box? And then I've got Lizzie Kate's Night Before Christmas Sleds sticker. And I've actually finished one of these. The Little Santa one. I'm now working on the little mouse. Which I really enjoy these, I just don't know where to get the sleds from. I cannot find them anywhere. <coughs> I made a start on front now. 
I just couldn't resist. That that one again. But I don't know if I should have got a lighter fabric. This is the one it says it calls for, which is 32 count linen twilight blue, size 19 by 27. I just feel like it needs a lighter colour because. how much I've done but you can't see this colour here very well so I might look into getting a different fabric and a lighter colour because I'm not happy with how that blends in I don't know yet Never fold fabric on. We've went away at Santa though. I have stuck gone to the ring because it's so many DMZ. I'm using the ring for big projects that have a lot of threads. Um, next one is an anchor bookmark. I think it's number one because it has number one up there. And I have done this much. If I probably concentrated on these, I'd probably get them finished. My oldest, oldest whip, which is my mum's, that's still not finished. So I have finished. January, February, March, April, started May and June. So I'm going to focus on finishing May, which is that one. I'm trying to get it done. This was meant to be my mum's Christmas present, my mum's birthday present. It's just not happening. But I will get back to it and it will be finished. And then... Oh, I think my laptop's going to die. My tortoise is all the way down. One second, let me grab my charger. My laptop. With this one, I've made a mistake up here and down there, so I'm just not finding the motivation to finish it. So that's my part. Of the I will find a mistake and fix it. So that's all for my whips, the ones I'm focusing on to finish. And then the next is my other whips that I want to get finish, finished. 
but I'm not going to focus on them now. I'm not going to really think about them until I finish either I finish one of them. So it's either going to be a new start, which I don't think it's going to be, and then it's going to be one of the ones. So my others are this big pile that I want to get through. One of them is Flip It Lizzie K Joy Christmas Blessing with Chunk. I have done that much. on that one but I put it to one side for now and the other one hasn't been one this one hasn't been started but I finished one of them so I have finished that one and then I've got that one that one and that one to do so it's already kitted up to start and this was my which was my other thing. This is the one I finished. So it's not fully finished object, but it is a finish. I've got everything ready to go to start the other one. It's all in there, ready to go. One, which is baby snow leopards and I have done So these all just when I've started the new things. That's why they haven't got much, so I'm not going to focus on them. That one's not started. I've got. Beatrix Potter, these are from Hobbycraft and I've done all the stitching just can't bring myself around to finish the back stitching because it's on Ada and if you look at this look at all that back stitching on Ada so the other ones I have I might just do change the fabric and redo this one on the same fabric not started that some of these are just kid up things then the boffy boff boffy threads peter pan this might actually have to be when i finish one of them the next one that comes out because i know quite a bit on that one and I love this fabric. Just love everything at the moment. Then I've got Free as a Bird from the Cross Stitch of September 2015. 
and I have done only them three beds. And then the last one. That looks so chart is the London one from CrossFit Crazy issue number 202 from May 2005. That one. And I have done that much. That's my other whips, my whole, my whips. Um, if you think, really, um, a couple of questions. How does everyone get their stash, their fabric stash, so big? I find it so hard. I just order fabric for each project. But I want to start. Again, more fabric and more threads and more patterns. <laughs> um, yeah. And how does everyone plan what they're going to stitch on? Let me know in the comments below. And anything that I've shown today, I will try and leave in the comments below. In the description below of links where to find them. I hope you're all having a nice stitchy time and I will see you back here very soon. Bye!